Good morning, Platte River Academy. Happy Monday. I'm so sorry we had some technical issues this morning and it's, you weren't able to hear anything that we were saying, so that's a drag. Um, I did want to tell you um, happy Monday and I wanted to say how fun it is to see how teachers are dressed today and how many of you are dressed. Um, mixing and matching your patterns, polka dots and stripes, they don't even really go together, do they? Well, maybe you wouldn't choose to wear this every day, but when we put patterns together like polka dots and stripes, it does really make you stand out, doesn't it? So why did we tell you to mix it up today? Because we think it's about time for a little bit of fun around here. This has been a pretty mixed up school year. We're doing more than ever on our computers. We've been wearing masks. We've been cleaning desks. Um, we've got, we've even got some of our friends learning from home. And at points we've had entire grade levels um, that have been e-learning outside of school. These changes were put in place to keep everyone healthy. While this virus was making some people so sick, everybody in the United States has had to adjust to these changes. Actually, everybody in the world has had to change how they do school this year. Kids everywhere on the planet have been having different experiences in school all year long. Because it's been so challenging, people have tried to cheer each other up. And there have been lots of shout outs for all of the people who are working so hard to keep things going, even though they were so tired and everything was so challenging. Last year, if you remember when we were on, um, when, we, when schools closed and we were all learning from home, we sent cards to the folks um, who work and live in senior care facilities because we knew how hard those people were working and we knew that the residents were separated from their families and were lonely and we wanted to reach out. I'm sure you've also heard of special events to recognize doctors and nurses and first responders, the people who are directly taking care of the people who are sick. They keep working even though it's really hard and it goes on and on. We've also celebrated our teachers because of how hard they've had to work to make sure every one of their students, all of you, kept learning no matter how school was going. Our teachers deserve a huge thank you for all they've done this year to keep everything going. Thank you, thank you, thank you, teachers, you're amazing. Honoring all these people is important. However, it seems that there's been one group um, that's been left out when it comes to thanking them for the way they've stuck to it even though things got hard and for the way they've been willing to help others and follow new rules just because you were asked. I'm talking about kids. You have gone through so much this past year and it's about time somebody said something about it. That's why PRA's PTO teachers and staff, along with many of your parents, decided to dedicate a whole week full of surprises to all PRA students. We are calling this week Panther Appreciation Week, P-A-W, PA. Because we want to let you know that we notice, we recognize, and we are so very proud of you. Each day this week, we will be highlighting one of the traits we have observed in you in this last school year. Today, we're celebrating your persistence. When you keep trying to do, or doing something, even when you don't really want to, and you keep at it for a really long time, that is persistence. It's tempting when something goes on and on and on to give up or quit just because it's so tough, but persistent people don't quit. Panthers, all of you have shown persistence in so many ways this year. Think of all the things you kept doing, even when you didn't want to. Doing your homework, helping wash desks, walking the long way around the hallway, all the way around, carrying all your stuff around all day and bringing it home every night, because you don't have a locker, even though your backpack weighs about 100 pounds, 
and making sure your Chromebook is charged every night because you know you need it every single day. And for patiently tolerating tech issues like the one we just had with announcements this morning. And everything else we've asked you to do this school year. Thank you for persistently facing these challenges that have been part of this school year. Panthers are persistent. As a thank you for all the work you have persistently accomplished this year, I declare today a homework holiday. There will be no homework today at all. Today, you're wearing polka dots and stripes or other patterns mixed and matched together with polka dots and stripes and then eating pizza, polka dots, pizza, both start with peas. That's to remind us about persistence. So think about the ways that you have been persistent this year as you go through the day and think about persistence because it's not over yet that you're gonna take into fourth quarter. We'll focus on another trait tomorrow and I will talk to you about that tomorrow morning. The dress of choice tomorrow for Tuesday is camouflage. Please don't worry if you don't have anything camo at home. Just put on your browns and your greens and give it a try. We are so incredibly proud of all of you. I hope you have fun today and you know that we are so glad you're here. Panthers are persistent.